eye care experts have convened in Barcelona for ESCRS 2024, where CIFI also gathered to celebrate the 10th anniversary of their wavefront engineering technology. Ten years ago, CIFI not only pioneered the development of wavefront engineering technology, but also envisioned what has now become the point of reference in vision care, true wavefront visionaries. Let's explore their decade-long journey of development and the impact of this technology on achieving an ideal balance between quality and quantity of vision. The inspiration came from a journey to the US in 2008, where I met one of the greatest experts in wavefront technology in ophthalmology, Dr. Junzong Liang at the University of Rochester were licensed to other companies to use Wavefront to correct optical defects. The initial breakthrough was characterized by a deeper understanding of the potential of this Wavefront technology in controlling light and despite their complexity, it was uh, uh, clear that we were able to develop a very effective uh, IOL. The second phase uh, was very important because we were able uh, to develop a combined system as the well fusion that uh, include a complementary optic and uh, give the possibility to extend the range of vision. The final milestone was uh, to culminate uh, in the development of Evolux that include uh, all the characteristics of uh, monofocal extended IOL and uh, at the same time uh, represent the last achievement in the development of this uh, technology. When the light passed through our lenses, uh, the focus of the ray that passed through the central part of the lenses is different from the focus that is created from the ray that passed to the periphery of the lenses. So, when you have a lens that is not pure spheric, you can see that you have not a single focal point, but you have a sort of line. This effect is due to both positive and negative spherical aberration. This is a spheric lens, the light that passes through the center of the lenses have a focus, but the light that passes through the periphery of the lenses have another focus that creates an elongated focus. This is what spherical aberration works. Dr. Curatolo prepared a few optical profiles that were studied in the optical bench. We selected two to go further, eventually becoming one, the profile of the mini well. And that lens was so satisfying because uh, I never explained one mini well. Patients are satisfied, they can read distance and near, and I think that this lens really was the first of a new generation. When I started using the mini well in 2014, uh, since it was launched, my uh, first impression uh, was uh, a very good the focus curve uh, that was quite different compared to the ones that were available at that time. The CV lenses have a whole line which will give from distance vision all the way to near vision and each lens has a strength. CV has really been a great, great, great help during this time because they allowed us to better understand how this lens works, what are the intended targets, and they have really helped us understand how to choose the best patients to provide the best outcomes. At that time, we were already looking for presbyopia correcting lenses, and there were a few in the market I was not satisfied with. And so I thought the new idea might solve a part of the problems our pseudofecic patients have. Eventually, it proved to solve almost all of them. The reason why is because with this system, using spherical aberrations, we have the same result in terms of visual acuity, but avoiding the, the issue affecting the other technologies like the loss of contrast sensitivity and uh, some dysphotopsia, like halos and glare during driving at night. We have an, a platform that is more easy for our patient to complete the neuroadaptations. 
that give high quality of vision, but without losing the all distance clar clarity of vision, I think is the most attractive things, especially to me that convinced to work with the fusion system instead of other technology. You can break that down into two parts. It's important to deliver excellent vision. The second component is the quality of vision and that the CC Well, uh, well Fusion system does. The findings we had after three months were the same as after 22 months. So we can see that it's not a fluke, that this can deliver very good vision all throughout the patient's life. I have uh, uh, the eBlux that uh, can uh, uh, provide me with a good intermediate vision. Also in patients that were before, uh, I could not implant a uh, uh, diffractive or an of IR. So uh, it enables me to offer a solution for a presbyopia correction uh, with uh, no problems uh, and uh, uh, a good price. Well, thinking about Evolux and the journey we've had with them, it's an amazing story because it's already been 12 months, actually 13 months since our first implantation. We have implanted over 300 IOLs in this time frame, with most patients over 120 eyes having over six months of follow-up. And honestly, these patients were very satisfied because the lens provides amazing quality of vision, not just quantity of vision, in a new platform which is hydrophobic, so no glistenings, no issues, with such a low PCR rate of 2.5% after a year that honestly, we were surprised that such a lens could exist. So we moved on a further development thanks to their question, their scientific interest. I believe that they have a very big role in improving and in the progression of our development. It is true that uh, back in 2014, uh, wavefront technology was already used in ophthalmology, but that was to correct optical defects CP has made a long-lasting impact in ophthalmology because we were the first company to use spherical aberrations to provide additional benefits to patients. You know, we will continue to invest to generate additional innovations, leveraging on our proprietary technology platform where we've been uh, pioneers since 2014 as Wavefront Visionaries. As CIFI celebrates a decade of wavefront engineering technology, they continue to push the boundaries of what stretching light can achieve. By putting it in the hands of those who mastered this technology, CIFI empowers them to broaden the possibilities of people's vision and therefore the potential of life.